afternoon and it's a thundery one so maybe my internet will hold up through the thunderstorm i don't know because sometimes it knocks it out a good crack of lightning in it go i'm dead so maybe we'll make it through mike whaley danielle gray apocalypse survivor robert reynolds john mack hey nightbot and pt3d's in the house how are y'all hope y'all's afternoon is going great what's up hawk 3d proto and there comes Robbie Mack with the Thunder Cups. Thunder Cups! Yeah. Do some ACDC Thunder Cups. Is that what we're doing? <laughs> Good day today. Good day. It's raining. Gray, it's, uh, it's hot here too. It ain't that damn hot though. Let's see what the temperature says outside. What's up, Matt? How are you, my friend? Glad you could join me on this beautiful day. Oh, God, it says it's 86 degrees outside. We're going to melt. <laughs> Apocalypse Survivor, our humidity is higher than that. What's up, Tyler 3D Prince? How are things in Tallahassee, Alabama? Minnesota Maker, what's up, my friend? Ed, Paul's Projects, what's going on? I did watch your live stream at work. I jumped on Mike Whaley's live stream at work. I come home. I saw some of Sean's live stream before I had to get over here. I got on the Discord and talked to the folks in there. You know, I try to do what I can do. I even tweeted a little bit with Ricky Tanner, talked with him a little bit this morning on on somebody's stream while he was still vacationing. I'm starting to print over here, and I want to make sure it turns out right. Yeah, I bet. I bet that, that does sound right. It really does. I'm, I, I, you know, PT3D, I can go back and watch some of, somebody was talking about your stream a while ago. I even got to talk to Ed, Papaw's Projects, on the phone today. So, hopefully I, hopefully I cleared things up about clear like mud. Alright, come on, get rid of, there you go. Hold on, I gotta see it. You know how it is. Gotta watch it. Oh yeah. Oh, that's gonna be fun. It's gonna be so fun. <laughs> if I can get that out of the way. That piece right there may be in the way. There we go. Man, I love some PETG. What's up, Paul Cumber? What's up, Sean? How are you, my friend? Yeah, PT3D. Papa had some questions on his stream, and I tried to answer it on there. And just that reply and stuff, I'm like, hey, man, just call me on the phone. Be, be easier. Better music here? <laughs> we don't have no music here. Justin would like to talk. All right. 
Destiny would like to talk. My daughter's calling. Where's the man of the hours? Oh, sorry. <laughs> Did you not like Sholem's music? Was it not to your tastes? I have to say, I, I like all kinds of music. I, I I don't have, I mean, I don't I don't know. I don't. I have a favorite. How am I doing? I'm doing fantastic, brother. Fantastic mondo. It was not country style. I hear you. Well, today's just hangout. I do like some operas now, Sean. There are some operas that I do like. How's the work going? It's a job, Paul. You go every day, you write some code, and you come back. You know, it is what it is. I shouldn't be getting any lags, Sean. Haven't seen any on either any of the analytics. You know, I keep the analytics up over here. So, Oh, no, I get you. I get you, Minnesota Maker. I know you're just ragging him. But, yeah. I mean, it is what it is. I finished some good code today. Got to do some more image manipulation stuff. It was good. It really was. Enjoyed it. I I, I like writing code. You know, it, it's one of the things of my job that I absolutely enjoy. Can't stand writing documentation, though. Good Lord. I ain't eat no catfish today. Has my has my what changed? The love for my job? Hi, what's up, Rob? Not today, brother. I like catfish. As long as it's freshwater cats, some butter cats, or uh what do they call them? The hell was that? I swear. Um hey, Opelousas or something like that? Yeah, Opelousa catfish. I like those. I don't like saltwater catfish of any type. Some people eat cell cats, but I, I can't stand them. Appaloosas. Not Opaloosas. Appaloosas. That's what it is. Big old catfish. They taste like scallops. No, no, no. It's a job. But, I mean, you know, everybody asks me every day how'd it go today. And I get that. What's up, trolling for dollars and Joseph? But it's, it's the same job I've done for 20 some odd years. So... I, that it's not a lack of enthusiasm. Mud cat, I don't know if I ever had that. Don't sound like the most appealing thing, but you know. What's up, Brian Vines? About time you come out to woodwork. But now today's just a hangout day. You know, we may go two hours, we may not. I don't know. We'll get it right. How many of y'all, I want to see a wait, sh show of hands. How many of y'all doing Wavy Wednesday? I'm doing my first one. My first one's on the table. Yeah, Brian, I hear you, buddy. You know, it's kind of like, that's what Chris said, too. You know, um, Chris said his job right now is just kicking his butt. Yay! I did. This is my first one. And I'm doing it in PETG. So I'm going to try it. This is my first vase in PETG. And I will tell you, the cup turned out good last night. And the bottom don't leak. But it, but it leaks out the side. <laughs> no, there's different types of catfish. I like butter cats. We catch butter cats here. What Harry Potter mirror? I said I wanted to print it. I ain't printed it yet. Got to need to fix the words on the one side. Bring them down so they match. It is pretty though. It did a great job. But tomorrow is Wavy Wednesday, and I want to. Build the MK3, Hulk. Don't go to bed until it's put together. No, I'm just kidding. 
So, yeah. Have a good night, sir. Sleep well. I hope you get all the sleep you need. I do. I promise I do. But today, today was a good day. <laughs> Take care, Hawk. It is sparkly, Brian Vines. It is sparkly. Sure, go ahead, Colin. Paul Cumber, my address is below. You send it. It will be on Mail Thing Thursday, and I will enjoy it, my friend. And as soon as I get shelving and stuff like that, stuff will be put up. I promise it will. Here's the cup. And the bottom held. The bottom is freaking solid. Nice. It leaks out the side. It looks like I had some under extrusion in one layer. You fill it full of water, and you can just see the bubble. It'll pop out on the side and then plop down. Plop out. Plop down. It's not like leaking bad, but it's leaking. Do I have any stickers? I do. If you want one, send a self-addressed stamp down below, and I will send you one back. Promise you. Now, I think I think I'm gonna take some of y'all's advice though, and just get some epoxy, and and line the inside of these with epoxy. I think so. I think so because that's um, a TPU liner. <laughs> that would be cool. Might be able to do that. But the. Uh, Somebody was telling me the stuff that you put on counters um, for your kitchen is uh, is food safe. So if you could get a smooth coating, just put some in there and roll it around and get a smooth coating of that to dry, I think it'd be fantastic. I don't know how well it'll stick. That's my only question. How well is it going to stick? I will tell you this. I like the color better. And I know it's hard to tell on the camera, but I like the color better of the one at the higher temperature. The higher temperature is a better looking color. A much better looking color. So, now I have three mugs. Three. Three mugs. And they, uh, they, um, they all leak. This is Inland PETG. I believe that's the box I got it out of. Yes, translucent orange inland. This was sent to me by, and I can't remember. It was sent, it was on the mail thing Thursday. You've been mugged three times, probably. <laughs> I do like the color. The color is a fantastic. It's a beautiful color. And this last one, I thought I had it too. And I would have if I hadn't had that under extrude. And you can see it. I don't know if you can on the camera. See, right? Right there. See that? Right there. That little bit of under extrusion. That's where the bubble comes out. Right there. What's up, One Raz? How are you, my friend? What you laughing at, Jeff Slater? raining outside printed at 450 degrees Celsius that'll work just fine then it'll print like butter or like liquid or it'll just smoke I, I wasn't mugged three oh well I guess so that's Brian Vine's dad joke no not literally oh yeah literally it would come out like Liquid smoke or catch fire. There you go. Print it, print it with napalm. There you go. I love the smell of napalm in the morning. What's up, Naked Designs? Carl Brown's in the house. Can I make your mug in green? What mug? What mug in green? I'll tell you this, the PTG, even with uh, Magic Goo on it, didn't want to come off of that. You want to print my cup? You print my cup in green. When did I say I would print you a cup? 
Oh, you would like your cup and green. I got you. <laughs> What's up, squirrel? 3D print noobs in the house. What's up, Daddy Rudolfo? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to drop the daddy. I'm just going to call you Rudolfo. Now I got bad stream. Why have I got a bad stream and my speed is higher than before? That's ridiculous. That's just friggin' ridiculous. No, not yet. I was waiting on it, but I think I will. This this iteration right here, I think we can do that. The one I just the one I just printed. I've got the STL. I can do that. I'm gonna send it to you, Llama, and let you put it out. It's your design. You put it out under your name. Just put country in it. That way we can find it easy. Thirteen hours till the UFO ships. Yeah, I actually talked to Josh last night. Sweet Rudolfo, my daughter's going into tenth grade. I will. I can do that. Not gonna do it while I'm streaming because that takes internet time to send it. <laughs> I try to be funny, Paul Cumber. Sometimes, sometimes it don't work, but I try. But we will be putting the uh, cup on Thingiverse, 3D print llama, and all you have to do is search for country, K-U-N-T-R-Y. Several things will come up, including the cup, once it goes out. So check tomorrow. Check tomorrow, Paul. But I talked to Josh yesterday, and uh, he's ready for the this this month's to go out and he uh he had a little setback but he's getting over that and it had nothing to do with the alien 3d boxes it was personal and uh he's getting there so we will we will make sure they get out and or he get we'll get them out he did post a picture did you see his uh did you see his um new digs he got that he's got to put the sheetrock and insulation stuff in he got him a portable building that he can actually use as his headquarters for the UFO box now. Give him a little better room. So, that'll help him out. I am too, Brian Vines. I am too. And I have no idea what's in it. And he was supposed to get mine out er earlier, but, you know, that's what happened. Matter of fact, I think he was supposed to send several out earlier. Is he right? <laughs> I've got two of them in my backyard that if I could clean one of them out, I wouldn't even have to build a room. I'd just insulate one and, and do it upright. Yeah. Clean new shed. That's right. Brand spanking new. And... The thing is, once he gets it insulated and gets him an air conditioner in there, it will be it will be a good place for him to be in. Okay, baby, be careful, okay? All right. That thing's going to be awesome. That that print is going to be awesome. Here, let me show you. Let me turn on my overhead. You can't really see it that way. Let me let me break it down for you. That's going to be my wavy. It's going to be my wavy, 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 whatever it's going to be. You'll see tomorrow. It's eight hours long. It's an eight hour print. Camera control, let's focus. Focus, apply. Okay. Okay. Sweet. Mother of Pearl. Yeah, it looks good. I like that. 
Yeah, the thing is, when I when I sliced it with Simplify 3D, I didn't do anything to it. It's the size that it said on Thingiverse. I didn't change the size or anything like that. I sliced it. All I did was took the same settings that I did with my cup right here. And I sliced it at uh, in vase mode. And it was 64 megabytes worth of G code. So a lot, a lot of G code. So, yeah, I don't know. I really don't know. Uh, sometimes, Paul, sometimes I do. But hopefully this will be done in the morning when I get up. And I will get it off of here and it'll look good. And I can take it to work and take pictures of it and post them on Twitter. And join in the Wavy Wednesday with all the other people. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. I figured Filament Frenzy would be on here. He's uh, he's out and about today. Doing a fantastic job. One of these days, I'll be able to print like that. One day. You use Cure all the time? I hear you. Well, one, thing, one reason I use Simplify is because Tom, Filament Frenzy... Let me have his uh, profiles, and they are they're pretty daggum good. So I use his profiles, and prints turn out really nice. But this one, this one's turning out pretty good too. I have to say. The Monoprice Select MP Select Mini. Cure is all you use. That's because Carl Brown is hard. Get on it, Llama. You got to get it back together. I want to do some cloth printing. I need to get me some screen and try, just try some cloth stuff. Try some dragon scales or something. Just something that looks cool. You broke it driving home from Earth? Eh, I understand. Paul Cumber, what kind of 3D printer would you like to buy? Tom, that's the way I feel about videos too, man. I'm not lying. That's the way I feel about videos. So many videos in so little time. A big rep one. Get some tool at Joanne's Fabric. I, I could do that. Or I could get tool at Walmart. Well, it's in vase mode. Yeah, see, I can't, I can't really do that at work. All right, Robbie Mac. That's right, Tom. It's my first wavy print ever. Ever. I have never done a wavy print until now. And this one should be done by tomorrow, so I can take a picture and post it. And not only am I doing my first ever wavy print, it's my first ever vase in PETG. You're welcome, PT3D. Is any okay?
That thing's gonna be cool. That thing's gonna be cool, Tom. Yeah, somebody posted something about their new music or whatever. It's a it's a wavy thing for Wavy Wednesday. <laughs> Oh, God, we got Annie, are we okay? And then we've got Annie the Musical going on here with Carl Brown. Go tweet this link. What link? It's just a vase. No, it, you know, everybody does the Wavy Wednesday thing. And, uh, yeah, but it won't be done till tomorrow, Mike Whaley. And I got to be able to shoot it to put on Twitter, right? But uh, everybody post those. That's right. That don't even make no sense, Brian Vines. Come on, man. I'm hoping that the PETG will be tough for a vase. You're a smooth criminal. Dude, it's just posts that people have been posting these wavy stuff. Tom did one a week or so ago. And it's pretty good. He did a bowl the other day that was freaking fantastic. It was last Wednesday, I guess. You had to change to Oh, I got you. What's up, Light Speed? Later, Paul Cumber. Come back and see us, my friend. And don't forget, if you want to send the mail, it's down below. And uh I'll send you some stickers back, buddy. You definitely will get some. I did get word that Red Light got his package today. I will send David Olson's off on Saturday because I now have a good address. I need to check my uh, air nozzle under there because I'm printing PETG and I have a PLA nozzle on here. Stop, stop taking about you. I ain't taking nothing. I ain't taking squat. Are you at that crane yet? You home? Later, Paul. But no, I figured 118. Yeah, my daughter said that it was 115 and getting hotter. You didn't get any stickers at Earth? I had a can full of maker coins. And the stickers were right down beside them on the dadgum table. Yeah, the, the nozzle where the air, the air chute, whatever you want to call it. The, the, the air chute that goes down from the fan and kicks out at the fan, at the uh, park cooling fan. Print some camels. Print a llama. Print a llama. Print a llama. A llama llama a llama llama. Stream tweeted. Oh, you tweeted out my stream. Thank you, Tom. You're so nice. Yeah, this was actually done by uh, 3D Printing Llama. 3D Printing Llama. He modeled that. He also modeled my head. Here, model my head, and he modeled my cup. Model my cup with my face on it. Llama, llama, ding dong. You need that head. It's it's on Thingiverse. 
Print it. Where'd you post it? Red light in pick spam? I haven't been on Discord. Oh, dang sure. It's even the right colors. Ha <laughs> ha. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Hey, I like that extrusion you got in front of it too. That's a good looking extrusion you got printed there. Fantastic. Look at that, Brian Vines come up with the llama llama ding dong. English people will get llama llama duck. I don't get llama llama duck. And really shouldn't get llama llama ding dong. Hey, Robert Reynolds, you're supposed to post them on Twitter with Country Club on it so I can search and find them. But yeah, the, the head on Discord looks good. Good, red light. Oh, uh, I got you. I'll pee myself laughing. It better damn sure be funny if I'm going to piss my britches. Oh, I got you, Robert. No? Play Duck Duck Goose? Never heard of no dang llama llama duck. <laughs> yeah, but it was wasn't it uh Shamalama ding dong. I I might do that, llama. I ain't gonna swear I'll get around to that one. I'll try though. <laughs> yeah, Shamal wasn't it Shamalama Ding Dong in Greece? Think so. But yeah, if you get on if you get on Thingiverse and you just search for country K U N T R Y. There's several things out there. It's kind of scary, actually. Kind of scary. <laughs> Go ahead. Let me see. K-U-N-T-R-Y. Oh, yeah. There's several things. Yep, even the uh, Death Met Owl is on, out there under Country Club. And Ken gave me a shout out in his AM8 printed printer. Got the uh, new Country Buddhas out there. How did the new cup turn out? The new cup turned out fantastic. It looks so pretty. And the new higher temps work great. But right here, right there, you see that line right there? Had some under extrusion in that one spot. One spot right there. And when you fill it up, it pops out. Bloop. Bloop. And drips from right there. It drips water from right there. God dang it. I know, right? Hey, like that cup. Sean needs a cup. You need a cup, Sean? That way, when you're drinking coffee, you can look at me anytime you want to. What's up? <laughs> And if you put rum in it, the more you drink, the better I look. But yeah, if you do a country search out there, and then we're going to put the cup out there. And see what else. Yeah, no. Nah. I got a mention in Discord. I'll read the. I'll, I'll watch that. I will. All right. So let me go and 
I'll go to my Gmail. I probably do it with the epoxy. Um, that way. Yeah, Discord's always up, always up, and always on. What's up, Chris Freeze? How are you, my friend? All right, so let me reply here, and I'm going to attach. I don't want the G code. I want the STL. Right there. Six megabyte upload. So this may slow my internet down. It is actually slowing it down quite a bit. Quite a bit. We're gonna is it gonna hold? Nah. Alright, Llama, I've got it ready. I'll shoot it right after the show's over. Cause yeah, it's just that's too much. What's up, Mr. Buttram? How are you trying to sneak up in here? Sneaking in here. Man, if that holds and that prints as good as it's looking right there, that is going to be pretty. And you can't really tell on there. I hope I can shoot it outside tomorrow and get the light just right. And get that thing in the light because that orange is, that's going to be pretty. Finally caught an evening stream. Well, good for you, man. I am glad you're here. I promise you I'm glad you're here. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, please direct your attention to the bottom of the chat window where it's Fernando Pena entering the arena. What's up, Fernando? How are you, my friend? Yeah, just... What's up, Vince? No sneaking in by you? What? <laughs> <laughs> no no I know that I know that Sean I, I understand but I'm pretty sure that in his lifetime that he has heard that five million times if not more well Fernando you know what's funny is <laughs> yeah no I got you but what what's funny, Fernando, is that I, I thought about not doing that as much anymore. But it's, especially in the evening streams when my granddaughter's watching, she likes Nano Pina. So I have to do Nano Pina. So I have to do the Nano Pina. Yeah, it's not about you anymore, Fernando. It's taken on a life of its own. It has. I pronounce it correctly, Sean. <laughs> Thank you, Tom. Man. So I'm getting lots of email. I don't get no email. Nobody love me. <laughs> That's why I do it. It's called the Gator Good, Fernando. Get it right. Gator Good. And that's a thing. You can actually look that up. Well, show them I look at your name and I don't know how else anybody would pronounce it. I, I don't I don't understand how it would look. It is Doctor Who. But I don't I don't know how else anybody would pronounce S H O L M. I mean Shamal? 
I, Shalom? I, I don't know. So I, I don't, I don't, yeah, I don't know. Come, man, smash the thumb. No, I don't want to smash my thumb. Shh. Brian Vines, you go fix some supper. Wow. Right. That's exactly right. Jeff Slater. It's not pronounced Bob or Tom. So I, I sometimes I look at names and I go, I have no idea how to say that. Shalom was not one of them. I guess I guess you could say Shalom. What's up, Joe Paddock? How are you, my friend? I guess I could call him Joe Paddock, but that just wouldn't be me. thing says it's five hours long cruising right along though that was actually the correct way to say it pad dock instead of paddock every time I hear your last name it makes me think of uh, Jurassic Park because they had them in the Tyrannosaurus paddock. Well, I'm sorry. I'm not going to say pad dock. It's going to be paddock. Paddock. I don't care. You can say it all you want to. It's paddock. I think you're saying your own last, last name wrong. I think you you pronounce your own name wrong. I think. I don't think you got it right. Nope, not the Prusa Research Vase. It is not. I don't even. Let me see which one this is. Let me go see. I did wavy. Then I went down here, and I got on here. And then I went to Fernando's page because Fernando does all the wavy stuff. She went to get my daughter and then she didn't come in here. I told her to come in here. I don't think it's an I. That's why I say paddock. 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 Yeah, I don't do it the other way. Paddock. So then I went to there. Let me see if I can find the one I did. I believe it was that one right there. It was. If you want the thing that I'm printing, here it is. Here is the thing I'm printing on the table right now. That's what is printing. That's pretty cool. Cool, man. Take it easy, Sean. That's true. I grew up with that name Walter, so yeah, I got it. Yeah, it is. It's a really cool orange. I like it. I like that, that color. It's actually, believe it or not, it's closer to this color than it is the color on that camera. Let me see if I can correct the, the color on the camera. Get that out of the way. Configure video. Let's go to the saturation. That's actually closer. There we go. Apply that. Hit OK. Hit OK. That's closer to the color. It's actually closer to this color than it is than it was the other.
He grew up with his name spelt wrong. Me? A lot. Yeah, no, it's it's more the color that it is right there than it is the color it was before. So that does look better. It does look better. All right. Yeah, it says we got. That's no, just wrong. My uh, my thing here doesn't work correctly. There we go. That's right. Let's go ahead and throw these right here up there. Let's talk about these nice companies. And I need to get some from Project Red and go ahead and put his up here as well. Since I interviewed him. If you say so, Mike. All right, so what's everybody else printing for tomorrow? Wavy Wednesday. Yeah, not red. <laughs> just, just kin, kending, kending. What the hell is kending? Damn, Mike, you come up with some new words. Chris Freeze got nothing. What do you mean you got nothing? That's right, Fur. Fernando, you see this? I just posted a link to your thing in Thingiverse. It's printing. <laughs> it's more the color it is than the color it was. That's right. It's hard to tie with gloves on. <laughs> You seem to spell shit, okay? Well, no, I, this is my first time ever, Fernando, doing anything wavy. No, you're right, Mr. Buttram, you're right. It's my first time doing Wavy Wednesday, and it's my first time ever printing a vase in PETG. I've never done a PETG vase before. So this is completely new, all the way around. Well, what you do, Chris, is you print like a benchy, and then you hold it for Twitter, and you go, that would be Wavy Wednesday, right? Wouldn't that be correct? Hold a benchy and wave, be Wavy Wednesday. It would be a print. That would work. Yes, PETG. I've never done a vase in PETG ever. And if I get it off the bed, but um, tsh, you got that, did you? I'm hoping that it'll come off the bed. That's the thing. Because you know PETG likes to stick to uh, PEI. I will tell you this. I could heat the bed back up to about 80 degrees and then try to get it off. Stand beside it and wave. Take a short video clip. Do the, do the parade wave. You think so, Tom? I actually had some magic goo on it. And that didn't help any on my cups. They were still pain in the butt to get off. I have not wiped it down with alcohol lately, no. Matter of fact, it still has a, a, a dry layer of magic goo on it. Well, if James says it, I guess it must be true. Oh, wait, you were kidding. Oh, damn. I was finna do it, James. We'll do a pants off dance off. My favorite Canardian says it. We must have to do it, right? <laughs> I was wondering about my face. That's true. That's true, James. What am I vaping on? Is that is that cones? Is that what you want that pronounced? 
Everybody welcome Combs to the Country Club. Hadn't seen that name before. I can't adjust my shorts while she's in the room, Carl. I mean, come on. What am I vaping on? I am vaping on a clone of Cutwoods Unicorn Milk. Come on, y'all welcome Cone Cones to the to the Country Club. Y'all are slow. This is a uh, a strawberry vanilla custard. That's right. That's the way to welcome him in here. Yeah, I make my own as well. Make my own juice as well. Yeah, it's it's called mother's milk, unicorn's milk. I mean, it's it's got several different names. It's basically the same stuff. <laughs> I hear you, Carl. I hear you. <laughs> no, Mike Whaley. That's what you're. That's what you're vaping. Mama would like to talk. Mama would like to talk. It's Mama. It's Mama. I know that's right. Thing about it is, it would be so fake. It'd be like, I vape my fart. That would just be the way it would be. That would be stupid. Vaping farts. You want to impress me? Vape somebody else's fart. <laughs> Mr. Butcher, I'm going to say challenge accepted. You just got to sell it. I hear you. Mr. Butt Vape. Good, trolling for dollars. Maybe you got some AC going. And it's not as hot inside. Yeah, my daughter said it was 115 there and still getting hotter. Because, hell, it's only 4 o'clock in the afternoon. That's just ridiculous. Mapro 6, I didn't see you come in, so welcome and goodbye all in the same shot. Have a great day, sir. Great rest of your day. 88 inside? Shh, I'd be mad if I come home and mine was 88 and meant my air, air conditioner was broken. I don't even know what I got my thermostat set at. 74, I think. No, because I'm not into RC planes. If I was into RC planes, I might, you know. Yes. Tell her when I get done, I'll come over there. Well, that's too bad. That's when I'll go. So you get me some more water, please. Come in here. Come in here and say hello. Come on. Come on. Y'all help me coach her into the into the room. Did she get a jackass by not 
Oh, really? Into the drainage pond over there? That ain't nothing in there. Come on. Get me. They're saying come on in. Say hey now. Hey now. Hey now. Bring me your glasses. Got to tighten her glasses up. <laughs> Hi, Miss Country. Bye, Miss Country. Get over that way. There you go. Yeah, they can't see you the other way. Disgusting. See if that's better. It was you she was embarrassed to know. You're printing a pink uniform for unicorn for somebody at work. She's not camera shy, John Mac. Now, my wife is more so than she is. Later, PT3D. Have a good night, sir. Have a great night, as a matter of fact. That thing's gonna be that thing's gonna be cool if I get it off the bed. No doubt about it. Alright guys, it's been an hour. You know what that means. You know how to support the channel is down below. Hit the thumbs up, hit the thumbs down, leave me a mess leave me a comment, you know, if you thumbs down it. Tell me why. And then, you know, check check out the links below. That's how you support the channel. My daughter's GoFundMe is down there. Check it out. She's got to go. What's up, Scott? How are you, my friend? Missing the hack monkey. Come on, woman. You're supposed to come in here and sit. Right here. Come sit. Come sit and we'll turn the overhead off. Come on. Sit down. Shut the door and sit down. S sit down, hush. I'm sit on my leg with no, I'm going to sit on this raggedy ass stuff. Oh, well. You'll be all right. You'll be fine. Come on in, baby. Take your coat off. Come on in. Sweet, Scott. There's no stream tips. No, I don't have stream tips. I have, you have to be monetized. So I have to have a thousand subscribers and get monetized by YouTube before I can get stream tips. So the stream labs or the PayPal me is the best way. Lightspeed, that's the best way to get me is paypal.me or the stream labs will actually put it up on the screen and uh, call out the message. What's up, Michael Castle? Yeah, that Streamlabs link right there will actually get your message up on the screen. Yeah, but it's what I got. Lightspeed, it's what I got. PayPal.me, that's there too. Are you going to say something? Are you going to say hey, everybody? Hey everybody. Hey everybody. Hey y'all.
You could mail a check. My address is down below. Yeah, Robbie Mike, my affiliate link's not working. I've got zero purchases. Brian Vines bought twenty three hundred dollars worth. I can't see if I'm smiling or not. I got a big ass bowl. Brian Vines bought twenty, some two thousand some odd dollars worth of stuff. Apocalypse survivor said, "Hey, you." And red light said, "Smile." It's not that bad. I said, hey. And Lightspeed asked, "Did you do you hate this 3D printing thing? I'm keeping up with chat. No, you're not. Mm -hmm. No, I don't hate the 3D printing thing. Kind of gets on my nerves that he's back here all the time, 24-7. And I said, hey, y'all, that includes everybody. I do. I do, Robbie Mac. You're right. I do need to check into I need to call Amazon. Because I just got a thing that said you got 90 days to sell something or we're taking your link away. And I'm like, how the hell are people supposed to buy stuff if it ain't working? Yeah, he does get on my nerves. That's right. Jeff Slater, you got that Every right. Every day. Every day. <laughs> Can you call this girlfriend and tell her it's a good thing? Uh, She's not quite there, Lightspeed. It don't aggravate her as much anymore, but she ain't quite there that it's a good thing. Yeah, it's it's just a thing. Right. It's just a thing. Well, since you're on that side, I can still put that back up over there. That's the one thing my wife don't... That's what she said. She, uh... She doesn't really like it that I'm back here a lot. Because it takes... Actually, the 3D printing doesn't take as much time as this does. This takes a lot more time than 3D printing. She does have a point, Tom. No, it's not that. It's just when you're on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Saturday, Sunday, Sunday. Won't be Saturday, Saturday anymore. <laughs> James gonna tell you not you don't 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 smoke my vape because we know where it's been. <laughs> and then he's gonna say don't pull his finger. Dude, right now, and and uh, if you go out to, uh, what you call it, what's the name of that? Um, Social Blade. You can check what your stream would, what your channel would be making, theoretically, if you were monetized right now. Mine's 3 to $40 a month. That's, that's what mine would be making. So, without donations and Patreon, you... Until you get 300,000 subs or so, you're not going to make money on here. You know, I looked at Joel Tellings, and on his Facebook revenue, it's anywhere from like $400 to $5,000. James going to say, money, then the power, then the women. The money, and the power, and the women? Yeah. You're going to have the women just falling all over you? Yeah. That's it. You know what you said? We men. Not women. We men. Them men. <laughs> well, there you go. That's a, that, You're on well, the blog for coffee lovers? I'm a blog for coffee lovers. We you men. are on a blog for coffee lovers. Maybe trolling for dollars. It really depends. And you also need... Well, he is, but you have to diversify. You can't just depend on YouTube to make that money. You've got to do affiliate sales, get sponsorships, and do things of that nature. And Patreon's a big part of it. You know, Joel Joel took off how much he's making on Patreon. You can't see it anymore. And I don't think you can see it on Tom's either. That's a shirt. That's a tube of lipstick. All right.
Right, plus Patreon, right. There you go, print and play. That's exactly right. He's got all of that stuff. Y'all take care, Red Light. Be careful out there. Bye, you ain't seen a older on no bike. Yeah, I'm pretty sure Joel's Patreon's two or three thousand dollars a month. I know Tom's is. So when you take that two or three thousand plus the probably two three two to four thousand um on YouTube plus I don't know how much affiliate sales or merch sales he does, but you're talking five, six, seven thousand dollars a month on average. Later, Apocalypse Survivor. Really? Hold on. I want you to post the link. All right, Robbie Matt, you can post the links now. Well, and that's true. That's true, trolling for dollars. That is absolutely true. That's what I was talking about, a coffee blog. Well, and Lightspeed, if you go out to my Patreon, that's out there. <laughs> you can you can actually see it. I <laughs> know. Why the hell is this on this blog? <laughs> I thought they wanted to sell their Espresso coffee. machine lovers, morning coffee, or what? Oh, sales on their coffee pot just went down. I need to contact these folks <laughs> and go, why the hell are you showing my video on your page? <laughs> No, I do. I mean, I, you know, I'm, I'm completely transparent on that. I mean, it just, <laughs> there's no need. That's funny. <laughs> it did get better, Minnesota Maker. I moved over here. <laughs> WTF? That's right. <laughs> Well, and that's true, Scott. But the the thing is, though, if I'm if you put it all out there, if you leave it all out there, you're not trying to hide anything. And I'm not saying that Joel and him are. I mean, they may not. It may be a legal thing. I don't know. Mountain Dew Green. You know. Oh, no, 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 no. That's not true. Because I got contacted by Creality to ask me to look at one of their printers and review it. Believe you me, I may not ever get another one free. But you'll get the honest opinion of what I think of that printer. I have a product here that you will see on Mail Thing Thursday that I have to start evaluating. And I'm going to evaluate it honestly. I, it's just the way it's going to be. Really, Scott? You think so? Why? Oh, uh, I got you, John Mack. Still ain't raced that board yet. Mm -mm. I can't get over there. Too much shit in the way. Well, and that's the thing. Like speed, you're right. But I'm like James. I'm not going to recommend something to you that is crap. All right, Robbie, Matt, when did you buy it? Let me see. No, I don't know that. AVE channel. No, I do not. If you bought it today, oh yeah, this morning, it wouldn't show up till tomorrow anyway. But I've got zero. Nothing. In the last 30 days. No clicks, no nothing.
So I need to I need to call Amazon and find out what the heck's going on. He said yesterday. And I should have one link. That's what I should have. One link for all of them. One tag. Doesn't even, doesn't give me a link. I need a damn, just one, the link. What's up, David Olson? How are you? Okay. But yeah, I don't know. But we'll see. I will t I will call Amazon and find out. Cuz if you're buying stuff then <laughs> I hear you, David. That's cool, man. I'm going to get your package in the mail this Saturday that I didn't get out last Saturday. Okay, so I've got my store, but it doesn't tell me how to create the link for my store. So I don't, I don't even know how to do that. It, it does product links. But there's nothing on here that shows me how to get my regular link. I mean, I just want something that says send people here and let them let them shop. Yeah, it's a whole bunch of a whole bunch of crap there. <coughs> See what I'm telling you. From the drop down menu of your account, click on your account. Hold on. I don't have that. Account settings? Your associates account? Oh. Is that what it's talking about? Manage your tracking IDs. It doesn't even. I don't know how to how to get to it. It says. I know what he's saying. That's a different. That's a different account. Anybody know how to do that, James? You know how to do that? No, it's fine. I told you this was just a hangout today. So if I go to my account, this is on my personal page. Believe you me, you don't interrupt. He never do it. Let's scroll all the way down. Where? Personalization section. I don't see that. Not seeing it. Not seeing it.
just being stupid. So, where's my link? Let me go look and see what my link is. She said you was done? I told her it was done. Okay. Let me see if this works better. You know you're ignoring them, right? I know I'm ignoring them. Ah, that's not it. <laughs> I don't have any idea how to do this. You keep up with chat. You talk to him for a minute. I ain't saying nothing. It's because you ain't saying nothing. I don't know. Welcome to my world. This is how I feel all the time. I get ignored just like this all the time. See, that's the thing. I don't think it matters. I go to here. Yeah, that doesn't matter. I don't know. That's just stupid. I need you to find out. Thank you. I do have an affiliate account. I'm on the screen. Affiliate-program.amazon.com Home. It gives me product linking, promotion, tools, publisher studio, link checker, product advertising API, link your accounts, link builder, reports, and help. Yeah, no, the thing is, under the associate account, there is no, yeah, I go to account settings under my associate account. Yeah, I just rather him ignore me most of the time. Right? I hear you. That's when promo. we do our best agreeing, right? It's when you ignore me and we don't talk. The print is not upside down. It's a, it's a vase. Jeff Slater, so it goes in and then comes back out. Oh, goody, another vase. It's a Wavy Wednesday vase thing. Yay. A vase is a vase. I don't care how wavy. Right, that's, that's, I got that from a Chris vase. Riley, I think it's that. It's a vase. I'm awesome. Why am I awesome? Must be somebody. You else. are awesome. Oh, <laughs> uh, because I know how to stop ignoring. Just uh. for you.
Si Fadil Bahar Nah See, if I create a link to a product, it's got to know that I sent it to it, right? So let's go to product links. Well, because if he gets his own affiliate account, then he gets a discount on everything he bought. Right? right? Let's see. If I say... Why don't you just write the title of this string? Ignore all your viewers. I can do that. This is ignore all your viewers. That's what this is. Uh, just in case you guys didn't know, you guys are obviously married. Did you know that? Uh uh. What? Right. Mm -hmm. Are we married? Mm -hmm. How long have we been married? Five years. Five years? <laughs> five years? You owe me $500. Told you it was $100 a year. <laughs> Twenty-three hundred dollars. Twenty-three hundred. You owe me twenty-three hundred dollars. No, you All owe right. me twenty-three hundred dollars. No, it won't. That won't get his attention. Wonder if it'll work that way. Got it. You bite my ear. I I'll bite gonna, my ear. I ain't gonna play. All right. Mike said, "Where is your most favorite place to eat where you live?" Why well, he said Lockville, Lock, like Lockville. Like, like I don't know. <laughs> what? Yeah, Walter's giving us um, giving y'all the silent treatment. Sorry. That would be probably Angelo's. So if I take that link, no, probably here. McDonald's. Let me try that. Michael Castle's coming up on being incarcerated five years in October. Oh, wow. That's cool. Ours is Sunday. 23 years incarcerated. Right? <laughs> he likes the country kitchen if he's small. All right. I yeah. know, yeah, he, it took you a while. You don't incarcerate it really been a car. Did you really think that I meant... No, you won't no, even... I, I know what you're talking about. He's been married five years. I understand the incarceration joke. I get it. You're working on a divorce. Right now. How much? You keep it up. <laughs> Which one? The one in Panacea or... Something else. In Panacea. 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 Because I don't know what that other word is. Tavares? Per. Amma. I don't know what the hell that is. <laughs> he said, never mind that. <laughs> Javaris per. Fuki uh, Amma. Uh, Katu. <laughs> what you don't say. <laughs> he was just stopping. Yeah, I don't know how that works. How'd you call him? I missed out on the bunch. Oh, Jeff Slater said it gets easier after 29, so we only got a few more years. It really gets easier after 29? It's got to. Can't get no damn harder. All right. Don't try to catch up now. Don't try to make it up to them oh, now. Oh, I can get, up. I can get on don't it. Don't try to make it up to them now. It's, you, you've ruined it. I need to, Robbie Mac. You're right. I do need to do that. 
Tell you what. I can actually look over here. Okay. It, what? Hey, you've already lost your hearing, so no, that that doesn't no. <laughs> Yeah, all those times are longer than your ages. You're right. He's he's younger than all of his kids. You and Todd is. Oh, okay. So he's in the distance age of 20 or whatever. No, he's, he's between Danielle and Sarah, I think. Oh. <laughs> Red light is once again not paying attention to... We got Panacea Flu Old. Panacea Flu Old. <laughs> All right. That, that's a new one for me. But yeah, Carl, by then you won't be able to see or hear anything that bothers you. Yeah, I know. <laughs> he spent 30 minutes playing on the computer. Hmm. <laughs> he said, I'm just going to start that. <laughs> what am I catching up with? She's keeping up with it. But you're not paying. You don't put Remy back here for you to talk. Yeah, you did. No, no. I'm not, I didn't come back here just for you to sit over there and talk. Stop. See? Said it don't work that way. Don't bring me back here just so you can talk. Ignore. I'm ignore. Ignore. My day was very busy. Just like it has been the past week and a half. Very, very busy. If all the shit had to happen, it happened. Yep. She's out. She will be out till Monday. Why does that not... Uh... Yeah, I went to check Glenn's, but he has they a... They don't care what you're doing. Shut they, your mouth. They don't care at all what you're doing anymore. I'm going to mute this your microphone. My, this is my show right what here. Just talk go about on. It. They don't care about what you're doing. Just go. You just keep on typing. Nobody cares. What, what is the... I got to see what the... What's the, um, it's Miss Country time. That's right. That's right. I'm going to I'm gonna get out of this chair and let her have it. You going to sit up here on the bar stool? No, I'm going to walk out. No. <laughs> then I don't have nobody to argue with. <laughs> Mike's gone. Later, Mike. Have a good ride. Yeah, I can go and cook dinner. That's cool. If you tell him to go cook dinner, he's gonna grab go grab a piece of pizza that's already cooked in there. Cause I cook pizza. I'm gonna have some pizza. What color filament am I using? Er orange. Orange. <laughs> Ah. 
See, I tried to get the uh, influencer account. Uh, what? Who's orange? Oh, it's uh, inland. Inland. And it's PTG. It's inland, transparent, orange, PTG. Yellow? She said. Is said, that how you say it? Yellow? Oh, or did you want me to say yellow? You want me he to wanted say to yellow. say yellow. That's so stupid. Yellow. I already have an Amazon Associates account. Aggravate me. Scott reprinted the new R2 parts for my MK3 and that inland orange PTG. What? I'm not going to repeat it. You heard me the first time. Why would you print R2? What What R2 are you doing, Scott? Thank you, David. Revision two parts from Prusa on the MK3. Oh, uh, I got you. That's what I didn't understand. What what R2 you were saying? Student life like so few pieces of grass cut. Did I still eat it? Of course I did. What student would I be if I did? Breakfast pizza. That's right. Put it in the oven and add some egg, sausage, and bacon. Show me the link they clicked, you bastard. Crucial labels the parts as R2. You what? Prusa labels the parts as R2. Yeah. Revision 2. I got you. I got some I have to print too. Print them in. Print them in black PETG that I got a little bitty tiny roll of from Prusa. Send it with the 2.5 upgrade. <laughs> Breakfast pizza printer. Robbie Mac, build a damn pizza printer. They already have one. Pizza and cookies? <laughs> well, I'm hoping to get that mod done because it's actually going to be an improvement. I think. What? He's talking about his mod. Riri? You can take my mod stuff off. He's a moderator. Uh, oh, God, y'all. <laughs> I don't. I don't think this YouTube and, and working is working out because he's losing. Trying to, trying to pay attention to too many things, and then Robbie Mac gonna give me a YouTube video to watch. But he was talking about you could take the mod stuff off. He can't handle it with all the great. Oh, like, do you is, get that now? This is the yeah. I understand. Okay, but you was talking about something. Like I know what I was talking was, about. Yeah. Build one, Robbie Mac. Miss Country says she wants one. 
She wants one of those. What? A pizza printer. I don't care for pizza that much. But if you could just print pizza anytime you want it. So I don't care. I don't <laughs> like pizza that much. Now if you can print me some French fries, then. I, I like, better watch it. Robbie Mac could go off on one of his kicks and ban everybody. I like French fries, but pizza. I'm not crazy about pizza. Carl Brown become an astronaut. No, she don't like pizza all that much. No, I'm not crazy about it. I will eat it. I just don't love it. Chicken nuggets, french fries. Cotton Brides. That's what it was. Cottonbrides.com. <laughs> Where are you from? <laughs> yeah. He said Russian brides. It was cotton. C-O-T-T-O-N brides.com. Go pick up your own there. <laughs> I think there's two left. I should have champagne and I don't like champagne either. And I'm not crazy about That's, steak. She don't, she don't do champagne and very little and steak. And I don't like steak either. How many no. of y'all went to cottonbrides.com? <laughs> That's what I want to know. How many of y'all typed that shit into your browser? I know you did. I know y'all did it. <laughs> I hear you trolling for dollars. I did that with ramen noodles one time. Yep, chicken nuggets and french fries. That or a good. chicken sandwich and french fries. Or fried chicken and no, french I, fries. I, I do or like... chicken fries and french fries. Or whatever and french fries. As long as it has french fries. Yeah, yeah. I, I do like steak. I'm just not crazy about steak. No, they're beer, yeah. <laughs> beer and french fries. There you go. I hear you trolling for dollars. I actually hadn't had a ramen noodle in a while. I'd like to have one. In the South, champagne is... Beer. Oh. And steak oh, is chicken. Oh, oh, oh. I was wondering what beef was. You can leave that asparagus gone. <laughs> she likes it. Makes your piss stink. It's okay, but French fries. French fries and fries. <laughs> French fries, fries and a shake. Funnel cake. Nah, no, I make funnel cake here too, but. French fries and Mountain Dew. There you go. Yeah, French fries and Mountain Dew, and she would be golden for the rest of her life. <laughs> Forever. There you go. You can't, you can't stand hot dogs. Hot dogs are okay. At $4? I don't blame you. I can't stand hot dogs at $4. Now, crab I like legs. crab legs. We yeah, do that. I do any kind of, yeah. <laughs> I hear you, Jeff Slater. That is a fire waiting to happen. Absolutely. And you'd have to print so fast. You'd be like... Two hundred liters a second. Good Lord of mercy! You just dumping two hundred liters in there? No, but it's so much better when you got the funnel and you put your finger over it and you move around with the funnel. It works really good. She likes funnel cake. She's not a real big sweet eater either. No, not like chocolate and stuff like that. I'll do yeah, stuff. she she likes those Ferrero Rocher, the little hazelnut mm -hmm. things that you buy, you know, wrapped in gold. You should have yours already, Robbie Mac. I need mean, more salty than sweet. Yeah, me too. I could eat chips all day instead of like chocolates and all. Well, at least she likes printed flowers. You're right. Yes, you can, because I can't stand gummy bears. 
No, I don't like. I like the sour gummy. I got a whole brand new bag of Harbos down here. It's a small bag. Tomorrow night, the Broken Nerd, right here, 6 p.m., 6 to 7. He's coming in. Live here. interview. He's going to be right here in the right. trailer home. Yeah, he lives better, right down the road. I hope you get him a better seat than this. Why? Because. What's wrong with his seat? Don't fall over, old woman. You might break a hip. <laughs> yeah, thank you, man. Nope. I didn't. I don't have no purple poly nor the green. No, he does not live near me. No, not even close. No. No. He lives as close to me as you do, Robbie Mack. With your new poly. Have you got some new poly? I've got the orange and blue polyophony. Right. Um, you and Todd, the ones that came with my Prusa that I put together when? February? February. What? The Prusa Mark III came in February because we took it to Murph, right? February, I ate five and left the rest of the bag up here on the shelf. So you crossed it and figured you'd make her a blue one. A blue and orange one. I know. I know what he said. I ain't made her one yet. She got enough flowers. She done told me not to print her no more shit. I just want no more vases or frogs. Or flowers. You got, you got half a dozen fucking flowers on your desk. That works. I don't see them. They're around there on the other side. I'm right. She don't even pay no attention to them. I don't care about no. Or, uh, or boats. I want no, no, you don't want no, no Benchy? No Benchy. What's wrong with a Benchy? See, and your Daniel's probably listening. You hurt his feelings. Well, I'm sorry. I mean, when you have a thousand, I just can't put a thousand and one on my desk. Printer new bedroom suit. Hmm. I need to build a bigger printer. <laughs> <laughs> right? Oh, I know. We know. But. <laughs> yeah, that's right. He gave her the one he got. You gave him. I did. Yep, I broke it. Well, you gave me the most brutal filament there is. We towed it at 16 hours home. And then you And then I dropped it. <laughs> like from there to there. At least it made it to Florida. A boat that floats in the tub. How about I print her a new tub? One that holds water. <laughs> you saw it. It was on stream. You saw exactly how I broke it. I turned around and it hit the floor. Yeah. Ain't that the way that song goes? Let the flowers hit the floor? Mm -hmm. You missed that? Well, go back and watch it. It's in one of my streams. You'll have to find it. <laughs> it's only a couple hours worth of viewing to find that one. That was the day after we came back. That Monday after. Yeah, the Monday after Earth. May have been too. Like we didn't come back on Monday. The day after we came back, that we came back. I didn't say it was a Monday. I said the day after we, we came What day back. did we come back on? Tuesday. So it would have been Wednesday. Uh, did I say it was a Monday? Yeah. I said the day you after. You said the we, Monday after we the came day back. after we came back. You said the Monday the after. after. No, let's day go after. back and watch day it. After. We got it on day record. After. I heard you. Day after. So the Wednesday after we got back from Earth. Not the Monday after. I really don't think he's going to scroll through all your stuff just to see you drop his flower. Family feud. <laughs> Survey says. Yep, says. 
Yes, I do, David Olson. I really do. We are at 23, Robbie Mack. It's 23 in five days, buddy. 23 married, 24 together. 24 together, 23 married. Oh, I got you trolling for dollars. I hear you. Oh, my goodness. Did your legs hurt? My knee hurts. Oh, you poor thing. I'm old. It's nothing like my back and all that. Didn't nobody tell little... you to sit up there? I told you to sit on my leg. <laughs> What's up, Kit? Well, of course it's still going. Why wouldn't it still be going? I didn't know. 18, 23 to <laughs> Time to get out the mallet. What mallet? Yeah. If it wasn't for the kids, she probably would have. I know you got a few years left. What's up, Vishal Pie? What? I said you got a few years left. Oh, yes. You got v about, Vishal. You got about three years left, and then I might be gone. I know. Three years, and she's probably going to go. <laughs> yeah, for knee fixing? Yeah, you're right. Half married, thirty together. So. Uh -huh. We'll get there one day, Jeff Slater. What's up, V Shall Pie? And I haven't seen Kit in the Country Club before. Y'all welcome Kit to the Country Club. Unless he's coming in under a different name. Y'all know how to type. Gotta make it to an even number, and then you can go. <laughs> okay. Well, three years will be twenty-six. That would be an even number. Uh. Oh. Uh, I am not. We shall. The V shall or we shall? I can't remember. You said it the other day. I thought he said we. I think he did say we shall. What's up, Antonio Nunez? Well, no, but once you comment, yes, we shall. Once you comment, we welcome you to the country club, Kit. That's just the way it is. So. Just jumped in here. We we felt the splash. You're welcome, Kit. Come back anytime, buddy. I mean, we're open. We're open. Don't go. Oh, was you hurting your finger? <laughs> no, my, my Just, just, just. Hello, my baby. Hello, my <laughs> darling. Hello, my rag time doll. Oh, You're supposed to be doing the frog. No. Thing. He was married for 38, 45 past <laughs> favorite filaments ah favorite for what because there's different ones for different things heck yeah heck yeah Antonio yeah Kit oh that was K-I-T-T -T. okay I didn't Night Industries 2000 Looking at the comments, I'm like, Dad, I'm coming up on 26 years. Well, color's orange and blue. Yeah, I like orange and blue. But for shiny, the polyalchemy elixirs. For glittery stuff, I like, you know, shiny, I like polyalchemy elixirs. Glittery, I like protopasta. For just everyday prints, uh, 3D Solutec. Orange and blue and purple. Purple is my favorite color. Orange and blue are my favorite team colors, which I print a lot of stuff in.
So that's that's not black and gold. No. Well, not black and gold. I like the song. I like black and white better together. Right. No. Why would I do green? Amazon Basica? Huh. Basics. Let's see. Uh, lost him again. Nope. Yep. From 1999 to 79.99. Pulling it up now to see what they got. Assorted. Bunch of colors. Miss you what assorted means. I don't know what you're talking about. Are you actually assorted, talking about assorted? Assorted means many colors. Several different colors. You get you five, know, a, five assorted colors. 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 Five assorted Yeah, I see the filament meter on the side. It tells you how much filament you got left, which is actually a nice feature. I do like that. Yeah, and you can get a five pack for seventeen ninety nine or seventy nine ninety nine. They got some decent colors. I mean, I have to try it out. That's pretty cool purple. I know. I like that purple. What about red? What about red? Uh, it says see. the end down there. Really? I'm not. That's a translucent red. It's not even a real red. And your favorite color is right there. Yeah. That's huh. Pretty, that's pretty color. Not a bad blue. I like the darker blue better. Oh, I know, but that's that's just a pretty black one. Oh, but yeah, they do. It's July okay. Black Friday sale. Well, that's fine. If they have any in stock, we shall. Yeah, Robbie Mac, I saw some of uh, Neary's put out some links today for some 999 PLA. What you struggling with, Lightspeed? Yeah. I saw that today, Neary's put it out. I don't got no money for filament right now. It's going to wait. I like the outcome. I got a roll or two. It'd be different if you had like the zero, but you know. Yes. Think about it is right now it's got the add to cart and it says usually sh ships within one to three months. Yeah, it is. It's close, yeah. It's close. Oh. A little lighter. Oh, well, yeah. Here you go. It's close, though. That's the same color, ain't it? Huh? That's the same color, ain't it? Mm, yeah. Yeah, you're right, Scott. Amazon's going to have to do better than $20 PLA because I can get 3D Solutech for less than that. No, we shall. I have not. Not yet. You'll get there, Michael. It's okay, Robbie Mac. It's close. Most of the stuff I I print isn't in Gator Orange either. And it's hard to find the Gator Blue. Right. Too. It's like the orange that my printers. No, we shall have not. Right, Scott. Oh. 
I have not backed any printer projects. Uh, Gators are green. green. You're yeah, right. The reason he said green. Ah. Uh, like yeah, but the University of Florida Gators is orange and blue. Yeah, but there's green on it too. I know the colors are orange and blue, but then they do throw. Well, the green, the Gators green. So yeah, I mean, I get that. It is green on the logo. Club is our Sweet Carl. But no, we shall I actually have one on my radar that I'm planning on backing. If I get the money. But I ain't had a job for two months, so for a hypercube kit. <laughs> no. No, absolutely not. And Robbie Knight said it's Fox Smart for future reference, so when he buys you some the orange for the prints. Fox Smart is the name of the You'll bet you can guess. I bet you can too, Carl. Or Lightspeed. No, no, it was Carl. No, I'm not I'm not selling hypercube kit print. I am not selling any type of printer kit at all. And it's not because I wouldn't love to sell a printer. I don't want to support selling a printed printer because the first thing they would do is test to see if they could break the extrusions. And of course you can break the extrusions. Oh, I can put together a parts kit that I've got on this. You wouldn't like it. Because if I put the controller board and all with it, I mean, it'd be a $350 just parts. And then you still got to get the frame. You don't have to support printed extrusions. True. A lot more work than I want to do. Well, because the board, you know I mean, with the Duet Wi-Fi and all that, the the screen and all that stuff, I mean, it'd be, it'd be an expensive kit. It wouldn't be a cheap one. Well, the parts list and drawings is already out there. It's the Hypercube Evolution. Probably not. A 20% margin. I'd have to look at it and see what it is. Yeah. Alright guys, you know what time it is. It's that time of night. Yeah, and the 101 hero was junk. We shall junk. From what I saw, I don't have one either. I watch reviews on it. So, anyway, y'all have a great night and, uh, We'll see you tomorrow for the interview. Good night, y'all. Take care. Way bye. Y'all treat each uh, other how you want to be treated. You know how that works. Especially her. Good night.